today, we're taking you on a journey down your body's information superhighway. We're talking about your nerves. Come and have a look at this. Now, where in the body do you think you'd find this lot? Is it A, inside your stomach, B, inside your leg, or C, inside your back? Well, the answer is C, it's inside your back. This is a spinal column and it runs all the way from the bottom of your head to the top of your bottom. Now, this spinal column is from a pig, but yours is very similar. The whole structure is designed to protect a very important bunch of nerves called the spinal cord, and it runs down this groove in the middle. And this is the spinal cord itself. The reason that it's so well protected inside those bones is because it's very important. It carries all the information from your brain to your muscles. And what's really amazing is some nerves carry signals at 100 meters per second, which is 10 times faster than anyone can run, even Usain Bolt. So how are they so fast? Well, we're going to show you. Hang on, that's the lunch bell. Woohoo! <laughs> Just a minute, Sand. It's not lunchtime yet. What's everyone doing in the canteen? Uh, Zand, what on earth is going on? It's actually part of a plan to show you how nerves work. Now, the lunch queue represents one single nerve. All the way along the nerve are iron channels, and that's what the people in this lunch queue are. They pass the message from one place to another all along the length of the nerve. OK, I see. So I represent my own brain, and I'm thirsty and I want a cup of tea, but in order to get my hand to get me a cup of tea, I have to send a message down this line, just like the brain would send a nerve signal down a nerve. So my brain is using the iron channels in my nerve to send a message to my hand for a drink. Mm, tea. OK, uh, milk, two sugars, please. Thank you. Ooh, this tea is very hot. I'd better send a note to Chris's brain, see what he wants me to do about it. Hurry up, Iron Channels. This is really hot. Ah! Tea is too hot. Hmm. Well, Zahn's message did eventually get to me, but it took a long time, didn't it? Well, from my perspective, the tea is too hot to drink, so I'm going to go back to the lab. Come on, Iron Channels. Uh, Chris? 